Hi, my name is Nick DeMaria. I'm a principal consultant here at Brocade Communication Systems. My responsibility is with the server connectivity group and our products, namely fiber channel HBAs, or host bus adapters, as well as converged network adapters. Today we're going to be talking about virtualization. What I want to talk to you about is the technology and where Brocade has taken this technology, namely NPort ID virtualization, or NPIV, and what we've done with it, and how we differentiated ourselves from the competition. And then we'll take that and move it into a real-world application, a real-world environment such as a database, like a SQL Server database. So let's start with the first part. Here on the board, I want to introduce what we have taken. So NPIV is a great tool, but people seem to be confused about how to use it. And a lot of customers actually come to me and say, it's too much trouble, it's too hard to manage. But if you wrap the right tools around this product, you're able to use things like quality of service, stuff that we already have in our switching technology, the ability to isolate data flow. That's a big difference. So if you look up here on the board with me, I'm going to show you what QoS looks like in a virtual environment. So if you're looking at the switch side, right here is this physical switch port. Inside this physical switch port, we have what we call virtual channels, these guys right here. A bunch of channels that are inside a physical port. Since this technology has been implemented on our HBA side, we also have virtual channels on our physical HBA port. So when we turn on quality of service, and this is where people get confused. So it seems to me that some of our competitors are looking at this like, this is not a solution. Nobody can do this kind of stuff. Well, we actually have taken virtual channel technology, which is a standards-based technology on our ASICs maybe like 8 to 10 years ago, implemented on an HBA as well with our fifth generation ASIC, and called quality of service. What we do, if you're looking at this board right now, what you're looking at on the HBA side is this, and the cable in between that goes to the switch, basic cable that you would look at. What happens when we turn on quality of service, we take this guy's worldwide port name and match it to a target worldwide port name, and we tie it together through these virtual channels right here. That means these virtual channels are isolated from any other virtual channels in these ports from anybody else's data flow. And I'm going to show you how this works now in a real-world application. 